Oh, I've done such disservice to Heidi over the years. It's so sad. Heidi is a lovely girl. And I've actually reacquainted myself with Heidi of late. And, and I'm even more impressed with who she is as a human being. She's a lovely person. Heidi was cast not on her ability as an actress, which is not to say that she's not a good actress. She's a fine actress. But she was cast because she looked like an actual person at NBC in a role that was supposed to be one line and never heard from again. When we did the pitch of the pilot in the show, she looked like an NBC executive that had been in the room when Jerry and Larry pitched it. She was hired for that look. And then George makes some reference after he has imploded in the room and made a, a fool of himself, and Jerry's chastising him for it at the reception desk. He goes, I think the girl liked me. <laughs> she was the girl. Somehow, that became enough for this connective tissue to make her the girl that George was going to have a relationship with. So now, what had been a look-alike casting now is, well, you're the girl. For whatever reason, I, Jason, found Heidi's comedy instincts to be the opposite of mine. So whatever I was trying to get going in a scene, I always felt like I was punching into jello. I couldn't get the right responses back. I'm sure she felt the same way, but she's the guest. She's not going to complain about me, so poor thing. And so I would go, okay, well, she's doing that. Let me switch this. Let me try and do this. And either I would switch and Larry would go, don't do that. Don't do what you were doing. Or I would switch, and then she'd do something else. So I'd go, I can't find a path with her. I can't. I'm always off. I'm just off trying to play against this actress. I don't know why. It was not that she was doing anything wrong. It was literally a chemical problem. And then Larry goes, she's going to be your fiance. <laughs> And I went, you're killing me. You're, you, I, I don't know how to work with her. I, it's not that I don't know how to work with her as a human being. I don't know how to work with her as an actress. I just feel like we don't have it for each other. And he went, that's why. <laughs> it's great. He said, I, it, what happens is we're neither rooting for you guys or against you guys. And that's what Larry wanted. And then, so we, we may do, I mean, she certainly, I don't know how she felt about me, I've never asked her, but, and I certainly would never have said to her, honey, you're killing me. Um, but it was, it, was, it was very, I found it very difficult and challenging to play scenes off of her. And there were times when I would be very vocal about that with the gang and go, I gotta tell you guys, it's tough. I know you're having a fun time, you're laughing. And the scenes, I guess, are playing. I just got to tell you, I'm way off kilter every time we do stuff. And they're like, oh, you're, you, she's great. You're great together. It's Burns and Allen, blah, 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 blah. You know? And then finally, they had to do a big scene with her. And they had a similar problem. And that's when we decided to kill her. <laughs> that's how that decision got made. Because they didn't know when we started that season, was I going to marry her? Was she going to leave me? Was I going to leave her? Those are the only three possibilities, right? That's the only... They found a fourth. <laughs> Sorry, Heidi. I actually, I have to say, because I know this is being archived, I really do like Heidi. I really do. I think she's a lovely person. I've, I've had wonderful conversations with her, and she is kind and generous and talented. I've seen her do other things where I thought, that's really good. There was something about, just something in the dynamic between her as Susan and me as George, I couldn't ever comfortably find my way. And it created something wonderful. So maybe that's exactly what it was meant to be.